and gentlemen, Professor Ping, I want to let you know that uh, a few weeks ago when I walked into the Bell Orchid Hotel to apply for the uh, elevator operator's job, the chief engineer had just walked out along with the rest of their staff. Um, who knows what kind of labor relations they had at the time, but they said, um, you look like a decent candidate, you're now chief engineer. And uh, I brought my trusted cohorts with me on board. Um, my management style is such that uh, everybody in the department gets to see the budget and see what's going on in the projects and we discuss what's happening. So they're all included in the financials as well as the practical points of uh, dealing with engineering. Um, so we are the engineering department and what we do is we keep the building grounds and um, all the uh, property safe and clean and in good working order for the, not only for our hotel guests, but our employees and the public in general. Our mission is to uh, maintain and repair these, uh, all, all the uh, facilities as necessary. And, um, and my personal mission is to try to get over this nervousness. Um, we have several uh, team members, myself, I'm the chief engineer. Um, my responsibility is just for the overall maintenance of uh, grounds and make sure uh, everything's taken care of properly and for the budget. We have Jackie Liu over here. Hi, who Jackie. is my assistant director of engineering. She. Uh, you can see here she has a, a lot of the uh, more clerical and uh, administrative responsibilities as well as uh, the responsibility of assigning the work to the shift engineer, Josephine over here. And she's the one that runs around and just sees that things are done properly and um, she takes care of uh, assigning to the general engineer and they work together. And as I mentioned, we have a general engineer who is Maria. Hi. And she was with Josephine and all four of us managed to keep this place from falling apart and keep it so everybody wants to come here and spend their money. So, we have phase one, initially we had phase one, since we're all new on the job here, we had a bunch of data that went together. How do we do that? Well, we organized it and we put it into a spreadsheet. And at first it was kind of basic because we just wanted to see what do we have here before we start making it look real pretty. Um, the first pass uh, of what we did is um, just gathering the information, organizing it, and we did it for the first quarter. Um, we wanted to discover what areas needed some attention. Um, after that, and from here, Jackie will tell you, there we go, will tell you about you. our first pass. Hi everyone, I'm Jackie. Uh, from this workshop, you can see the January expense of our department. Uh, we have 25 different categories, and um, but there are four largest the first largest one you can see is the construction and renovation of building. That cost, um, this one is the largest. It cost the $30,000 for the January. And the second one is the furniture. It's right here. You can see that it's 20000 And the third one is um, the cabbage and floor covering is right here. It's 15,000. And the fourth one uh, will be the, um, the elevator and elevator repairs, just 10,000. So, um, yeah, this is the four items, the largest four items. Uh, 
from this uh, from this chart, we can see the problem for the general uh, expenses. We can find that um, we can see the the four largest one here, and we can find the problem is the uh, secondary elevator in the lobby has the problem. We might need to replace it. And um, for the percentage, uh, we welcome Ms. Rosalind to explain it for us. was 8%, 8%, I think the same direction, right here. I don't know. Uh, can, you, can you guys, can you guys have? Yeah, we, we have, we have four, the four lines there. Construction and renovation. Oh, no, I mean, uh, I'm sorry. Furniture, 12, yeah, elevators and elevator repair, and yeah. nine, and was, yeah. recovery. The furniture was a, actually was twelve percent. Was the second one, and the uh, the elevator and renovation repair was nine percent, right? Yeah, it was nine percent, and the last one was, which was the maintenance of the contract was eight was eighty, I think eight eight percent. Yeah, that's right. So we had in, in we had a, a, during the quarter we have those expenses. This was the total of the quarter. But you, as you can see, uh, we the, the most lo largest amount that, that we had was in Mar was in January, and if you see, uh, 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 Joe, you're gonna s if you see right here, we have we can show you in in um, January uh, the highest the lower uh, the, the largest amount uh, as a higher than the other ones. 
In January, we had a, a two, like a hundred. In, in February, we have a uh, low, very low, a lower day than in, in March. And which is because you know, uh, in, in February, we, we didn't have the kind of expenses because uh, we know uh, when you talking about the construction, we don't need to do construction every month about uh, construction repairing those things like the whole, whole construction repair and floor covering. We don't need to do this every month or elevator uh, repair. We don't need to do it every month. So we just did it in, Mar in January. But in February, in March, we didn't do that kind of expense. We didn't have this kind of expense. That's why we, in March, in January, we are very, we get very high expenses. In, Jan in fe February, in March, we didn't have that much like that. So this was just the basic ones that we had in February, in March. So, uh, oh, I'm So, uh, Jim, do you want to? Do you guys have any questions to uh, ask him about that? Any questions, anyone? Questions, um, comments, insights? <laughs> <laughs> any questions? Okay, good job, guys. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, All right, very good. Um,